of this video, you will know how to write an award-winning horror short film with no money. What's up, film nerds? Today, I'm gonna break down how to write your first short film screenplay. And I'm gonna apply that process to a short film I wrote called Contaminated, which I wrote, directed, and edited the first week of the global pandemic lockdown back in 2020. So with that, my name is Brian Cleveland, and this is Filmmaking is for Nerds. As a first time filmmaker, it's essential for you to start with a short film screenplay that allows you to explore your creativity while working within your budget limitation. In this tutorial, we'll focus on finding inspiration for your story and transforming it into a screenplay that is both producible and showcases your unique voice as a filmmaker. Inspiration is everywhere. Look around you and draw inspiration from your personal experiences, emotions, and observations of the world. Pay close attention to the people that you encounter, the interesting conversations you have or overhear. Take photographs of beautiful and interesting places that you pass by and write down any strange and unusual events that happen to you that make you feel something. Reflect on your own passions and interests to find themes that resonate with you. My short film, Contaminated, was inspired by the global pandemic lockdown and the limitations that came with that, which I'll talk about more later. Read, watch, and listen. Read books, comic books, short stories, and articles to discover new perspectives and new narrative styles. Watch short films, movies, documentaries to study different storytelling techniques and visual approaches. Listen to podcasts, interviews, or personal stories to find intriguing subject matter and character inspiration. Contaminated was inspired by my love of horror movies and creature features, and also my love of David Sandberg's short film work, uh, specifically his short film, Lights Out. Keep a journal or idea book. If you want to become a writer, this will become one of the most important habits you'll ever develop. Carry a small notebook or use a note-taking app to write down interesting ideas that come to mind. Organize your thoughts, characters, and potential storylines in one place for easy reference. Don't worry about perfection at this stage. Just let the ideas flow freely and write them down whenever they come to you. And write down everything because you never know what those ideas might develop into and you don't want to lose them. For Contaminated, I wrote and developed the idea on my notepad app on my cell phone. Identify themes and messages. Look for common themes and messages that emerge from your inspirations and personal experiences. Consider the emotional impact you want your audience to experience after watching your short film. Align your story with a strong central theme to give your screenplay a focused direction. For Contaminated, the central theme was something like, you're not safe anywhere from a deadly virus. Develop compelling characters. Think about characters that embody the themes you want to explore. Give them unique traits, desires, and flaws to make them relatable and engaging. Consider the emotional journey your characters will undertake throughout the story. The journey is to take your character from anti-theme to discovery and acceptance of the theme. The anti-theme of Contaminated was something like... I'm safe in my home, which is where we all feel the safest, and it's the reason why horror movies that are set inside our home are so terrifying. At the end of Contaminated, the main character is confronted with the theme, which is, uh, again, something like, you're not safe anywhere from a deadly virus. Outline your story. Create an outline of your short film's plot, starting with the beginning, middle, and end. Focus on a simple and concise story structure so that the writing process is more manageable. Then make sure that each scene contributes to the overall narrative and character development. And lastly, make sure that you limit the number of scenes and locations. Contaminated was just one scene in one location. Start writing the screenplay. Begin writing your screenplay with free or affordable screenwriting software like Writer Duet, which is what I use. Don't be afraid to make mistakes or experiment with different storytelling techniques. Break the story into individual scenes with clear objectives and conflicts. 
With Contaminated, I wanted to get the film made and out into the world as quickly as possible so it stayed relevant. So I just wrote this single paragraph and used that to create a shot list that served as my visual screenplay. Embrace feedback and revisions. Share your screenplay with trusted friends, family, or online communities to get constructive feedback. Be open to suggestions, but remember to stay true to your vision for the film. Revise and rewrite your screenplay based on the feedback that you're given, refining characters, and tightening the story. Keep it practical and budget-friendly. Ensure that your story's locations, props, and cast are manageable within your budget limitations. Consider the resources you already have access to, such as friends' homes, public spaces, and borrowed equipment. Contaminated was made during that first week of the global pandemic lockdown, so the limitations that came with that helped me write something that was contained to my apartment with my partner Megan, Rebecca, and the camera that I had. Those limitations and the topical theme helped me write a simple, short horror film. Conclusion Finding inspiration for your first short film screenplay is all about being observant and open to the world around you. Draw from your experiences, explore different forms of art and media, and keep a notebook to write everything down whenever those ideas strike. Remember, filmmaking is an ongoing learning process, so don't be afraid to experiment, seek feedback, and make revisions to make your short film screenplay the best screenplay it can be. If you use anything that you learned here today to make your first short film, please uh, post it in the comments and I will take a look at it and see if I can give you any tips to help you on your next short film. And please subscribe to this channel, like this video and leave a comment so that I can continue to grow this channel and keep providing tips and tutorials based on my filmmaking journey. So happy writing, my fellow filmmaking nerds.